for the best view of the eclipse one in a 737 and the other in a two litre saloon so where are we going to watch it now then? possibly through the sunroof <laughs> in the traffic jam <laughs> and jane has second thoughts about her resignation it's been torn between two places really lanzarote island of sunshine and everything and luton airport <laughs> Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away If you can use some exotic booze There's a bar in far Bombay Come fly with me, let's fly, let's fly away Look at the sky, it's gonna be a good day A good day for eclipse watching, hey? Come on, Bear it's eclipse day, and away from his pilot's seat, Captain James McBride has brought his family to France, hoping Hop for a in. good view. But first, they have a long drive. Cabin secure. Back there, is it? Good. Right. We're clear for start, aren't we? Welcome aboard. This is your captain speaking. And we're on our run to the sun flight this morning, aren't we? It's going to be a flight of two hours, and we're going to be flying at an altitude of 0 foot 6, which is about, uh, ooh, 20 centimetres or something. We'll be cruising at a speed of about um, 80 or 90 kilometres per hour, and we would ask for your attention during the safety demonstration. Thank you. In Liverpool, the Barcelona flight should offer the best view of the eclipse, provided Captain Lance Jordan makes his time slot. How are you doing? Uh, not so bad at all, thanks. Good. So Good. you're all fixed for this uh, special eclipse flight, yeah? We are, yeah. Ho hopefully we'll be passing right through the centre of it. Yeah. Long. The passengers are kind of inquiring where's the best part of the aircraft to sit, what side? I'm sort of suggesting the left-hand side. I'm right in saying that. Well, I mean, it, we'll hopefully go right over the top of it. Right. Uh, so both sides are going to get a fairly equal cool view, really. Yeah. So if we get there bang on time, is it yeah. due in on time? or? Uh, it's actually due in at 52. It's due in in about right. seven minutes. So. Okay, I'll yeah. let you work that out and I'll come back for figures. Yeah, okay, Cheers, thanks. thanks very much. In Luton, they're too busy to think about the eclipse. Mm, what do we have here? A load of drums, a load of... Blimey, look at that. Katrina's got her hands full. How many of you are there, please? Well, we are a group of 15 people. 15? Yeah, 15. The Barcelona Dragons have played an American football game in Edinburgh. They lost, but you'd never get it from their supporters. At EasyLand, EasyJet's headquarters, the marketing department are making last-minute arrangements for the work summer party tonight. Oh dear, we've got a problem with the beer. No, I'll organise that and we'll set it all up. Yeah, we want an extortionate amount of beer. Uh, hi, Stelios, it's James. Yeah, it's just about for the party tonight, uh, checking that you can get to Alexandra Palace in time. If you jump in a cab as you land, then you should be there in time for the, for the start. Oh, that's great then, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Well, Stelios will be there and there'll be a lot of people coming over from Greece, so we're going to need an awful lot of plates. That's why we're going to up the numbers. But really, the important issues are going to be that it's going to be a voucher system for the drinks. Yeah, yeah. It's going to be like a sim simulated pound note effect. But instead of Her Majesty, it's going to be Stelios. Yeah, yeah. Maybe not as beautiful, but maybe, you know, certainly as rich as. <laughs> yeah. OK, well, we'll see you there about sort of 7, 7.30. All right, thanks. Bye. Assistant Supervisor Jane Bolton is getting ready for her shift. Last week she handed in her notice after being offered a job in Lanzarote, but now she's not so sure. I didn't have very long to accept the job that was offered to me. So, you know, automatically I said, oh, yeah. And then I said, no, I'll think about it. And then two days later I'm back and said, yeah, definitely. And the excitement was then, but it's... That excitement's fading now, and I'm worrying. So I'm not feeling like I should do. I mean, I'm quite lucky in the fact that I did originally give two months' notice, so I have given myself enough time, if I do decide to stay, to reverse that. But then if they decide that, you know, they're going to start interviewing to cover my job, 
what if they take someone on tomorrow to do my job, but then I turn around four days later and say, I want to stay now. You've got to think about everything, haven't you? It's been torn between two places, really. Lanzarote, Island of Sunshine and everything, and Luton Airport. <laughs> yes. Yeah, that's fine, that's fine. I need to ask for all everyone the security questions. Did they all pack the bags themselves? Ah. How many bags? Handbags? No. Did they all pack their bags themselves? Could you ask them, please? Oh. Que cada uno ponga su maleta aquí. Madre mía. No os confundáis de maleta ahora, eh? Could you ask them if it's all their own luggage, not carrying anything for anybody else? Could you ask them, please? No. A ver, John, mira para los infundadores de la Rioja, los antes. Okay, what's, going on, what's going on? It's all the luggage. Oh, yes. 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 Right, that's fine. Hasta comedia para traer las maletas. We've got a total eclipse today for you. On Liverpool's Barcelona flight, stewardess Janie Stock has been brushing up on her Spanish, but she just can't remember the word for eclipse. Adios. I just can't think what it is. I mean, I can, I can say to them, like, the, the moon's about to cover the sun, which is groovy, and not to look at it, which is quite entertaining, because EasyJet have, like, printed out that they're supposed to say in English um, about the eclipse. Ladies and gentlemen, this is about to occur on the right-hand side of the aircraft, but don't look! You know, I mean, what's the point of telling them if they can't look at it? So that's the PA we're supposed to be doing. But God knows what I'm supposed to say in Spanish. I'll just make up as I go along, I suppose. We have an earliest airborne, a 9.41 GMT, and the last airborne to make it a 9.46. Time now is 9.44, so we're right in the middle of that window. So we're going to take off right now, and hopefully, with a bit of luck, we should make it uh, right underneath the eclipse, bang on time. Cross set. You know, check. Positive time. Gear up. Oh, Lawrence, it's going to be a long day, mate. I tell you. With 100 miles to go, it's not going quite as planned for Captain James McBride. So times like these where you wish that... Uh, we actually set off at four in the morning, don't we? Really? Don't worry. It's all very well you saying don't worry. If we get stuck in a traffic jam that lasts two hours, we're stuffed, aren't we? Well, it looks like we're going to be the bang on time. The only thing I'm thinking is it may be an idea just to arrive 30 seconds this side of it so we get a better view of it. Yeah. So um, I may just slow up a little bit in a moment. On the ground in France, James needs to speed up if he's going to have any hope of seeing the eclipse. It's time to give up the pilot seat and have a go as navigator. Right. Let's just kick back and relax. Don't worry about We've the traffic. Come here for one thing. No, we haven't, darling. We came here for a holiday, didn't we? Well, where are we going to watch it now? Then? Possibly through the sunroof. <laughs> in the traffic jam. In Liverpool, there's no time for eclipse watching. Kevin's passengers are up to their usual tricks. No smoking, mate. We're fueling. You can't smoke here. Yeah, you can't nowhere. smoke. No, you can't smoke. Get rid of it, mate. Get rid of it. There's fuel balances around. You know there's fuel. Hey, it doesn't say nowhere, man. Tell everybody, man. Wrong everybody, no smoking. They're actually told not to smoke. As the aircraft comes on its final approach, they're told not to smoke until they get inside the terminal building. But when they're told not to smoke, they shouldn't smoke. Could, sorry, can we just stop you a minute? Apparently the cleaners are still on board. They've got to come off. Can we just let these people off, please, if you would? Thanks. 149 passengers have been sent to board a flight. Kevin has to stop them because the cleaners are just finishing. He's not to blame, but his duty officer doesn't see it that way. Prepare for you being out here to get that plane loaded as soon as possible. You do not delay the board of the aircraft. Don't need to delay the board of the aircraft. It's due out at half past Absolute It's the only just... Do your job or you go home, Kev. Don't go home, right? Do your job. I'll go home. Don't, don't be little right, to me. Don't be little to me. Don't try and embarrass me in front of these people. Don't stick it up your ass. 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 Don't stick it up your
just had a big shouting battle with him, and I'm not a bit happy about it. He really, really humiliated me for the ball of passes there. You know, instead of doing it in a professional manner, pulling me to one side and saying, what's going on here? He really did try to pull me down and make me look that big. Crazy. I think I'm going home, Jason, anyway. I'll, uh, I'll see what happens back there, yeah. All right, mate. Cheers. The last thing on Kevin's mind is the eclipse. It's certainly getting a little bit dull now, but I don't think, I think it'll all happen very, very quickly. So in the next five minutes or so, it should start to uh, really go quite dark. Señores pasajeros, como ves por la ventana, por la izquierda, los pasajeros por la izquierda, ya se pueden ver que la luna ya está tapando parcialmente el sol. Dentro de unos momentos, aproximadamente cuatro minutos, la luna se va a tapar por completo. Gracias. What the hell is the word for eclipse? <laughs> the moon will be uh, sort of covering the sun a little bit there. That probably sounded great, though. <laughs> The roads have cleared, but James has less than 10 minutes to find the beach. Well, uh, I'm sorry, straight on. Yeah. 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 yeah! Just park it up on the right here, and you get a chance. Right, let me park it properly okay. then. Turn up, down. Time's running out. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Captain, as you can see now, on the right hand side of the aircraft, the other lights are beginning to. Uh, Go very quickly now, and just around about uh, another four minutes from now, estimate the uh, temperature will be directly overhead. And then closing on the left hand side, so you'll be able to see the line. So just very clearly quickly. Found your spare pair of glasses. <laughs> Aren't you going to watch it? Go on. They're cool. You may be able to see the French coastline, that's more or less by the Deauville area just ahead just below the cloud there. Uh, and that's more or less where we're hoping to be as it goes overhead. In part two, it's decision time for Jane. And will James ever find that beach? After much deliberating, Jane has finally made up her mind. It's, it's been a very hard decision, but to go at this minute in time wouldn't be right, so I'm, I'm going to stay, I hope. Luton has won over Lanzarote, so I need to go into work today and uh, ask my boss very nicely if I can uh, have my job back, basically. I'm going to look a bit of an idiot, really, but there you go. I've changed my mind now and I'm, I want to stay at Luton. But saying that, we've got the Egypt party tonight, so um, I've got a good excuse tonight not to, not to have to think about it for one evening anyway. No, let my hair down. You won't go any further. What are you laughing at? <laughs> me? <laughs> Why are you watching me now? <laughs> I'm a Percy Vio, I'd never give up. <laughs> I know, the signs all aren't working, so we have to put this Glasgow sign there. Oh dear. But I've st stuck it in and I can't get it all the way. <laughs> Duty officer Graham Fraser puts his mind to the problem. <laughs> and find brute force is the answer. Oh, yeah. oh, God. It's all coming out. <laughs> you won't make me laugh, you see. Oh, it's gonna shoot in your eyes. Turn around. <laughs> Doesn't matter, you can break your glasses. Right, we can do. For Jane, it's crunch time. I'm going up to see my boss. I'm gonna grovel now. Wish me luck. Almost ten. And for eclipse watchers. And so in one minute's time that aeroplane of ours should be going through the shadow there. Well, we told Not a beach, that. but they have found a field. And just in time. Goggles on, matey. Goggles on, stand by. Okay. And there it is. Just a crescent left. Yeah. Oh, it's getting closer. Uh, it's getting there. It's absolutely dying rapidly now, isn't it? It's incredible. That's absolutely tremendous. Look at that. Perfect timing. That's incredible, isn't it? I don't think they can see it from that side, can they? I'm just banking the aircraft, um, changing heading by about uh, six or seven degrees each side just to show the passengers. Okay. Absolutely phenomenal, isn't it? <laughs> yeah! Oh, here we go. 
Here we go. Here we go. Oh, what? You can take your glasses off now, kids. Wow. 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 I wouldn't so, stare so, at it. For a moment, it's it quite reappears, exceptional, then isn't it? Yeah. Beautiful. Oh, here, oh, here we go. Right. Here we go. Glasses on. Glasses on. Yeah. Right. OK, one, two, three. Bring me sunshine in your smile. Bring me laughter all the while. In this world where we live, there should be. Oh, this, this is just so cool, it really is. Girl at the back there crying, the whole aircraft's on a buzz. It really is a fa fabulous atmosphere. This is brilliant. No, I'm loving it. We just sat here and you could see it on the engine, Kelvin. The reaction is there. I'm a nice Bicardi with a, an eclipse every time. Wonderful. Cheers. Groovy! I'm loving every minute of it. I can all get on with it. I'm enjoying myself. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, if I could just have your attention for a moment, please. I would just like to say a very big thank you to our captain, Lance Jordan, for getting us right through the eclipse and doing it so well. So let's hear it for Lance, everybody. <laughs> Yay! I'm staying. <laughs> what did they say? Yeah, no problem. She was really shocked, but really pleased as well. And, you know, said as long as I know exactly what I'm doing, it's my decision, then behind me 100%. So for now, everyone's stuck with me. Right, back to work. Chop, chop, get the passengers in shape again. It's an important night for Katrina. She's home early to get ready for the EasyJet party. It's a chance to show how far she's come in the last year since undergoing surgery for cancer. I mean, I can't help but feel I'm a changed change person, you know, inside and outside, actually. I obviously look different, um, and the way I think about things are different. Um, I mean, sometimes when me and June look back at the wedding photographs, you know, I actually see someone different there. I don't always see Katrina. It's a big night for Jane, too. Now she's staying in Luton, she hopes the party may be a way to shed her bossy image. When I'm at work and I'm busy and I'm stressed, I don't have a lot of time to say, how, how are you, how's it going? And I know I don't give as much praise as probably what I should do sometimes. And I think I come across as quite hard. I don't mean to. But, you know, when you go to do's like this, you can actually speak to them, they do realise that you are human. So... I have to go and say sorry to everyone for being nasty for the last few weeks now. <laughs> I'm being a bit down tonight. I'm wearing a little short purple skirt and a little short purple top. <laughs> I'm going to be showing off my scar. It's the first time I've shown off my scar, actually, you know, since my illness. Um, but, I mean, as Jenny keeps saying, Mum keeps saying, be proud of it, you know, that saved your life. And, and they're right, it did. So, I'm going to take a little leaf out of their book and be proud of it now. <laughs> and I think that's going to have to do. My hair looks horrendous. Wishing I've had a cough now, <laughs> like a boy. Party time, and there's no going back for Katrina. I must admit, I was very nervous about coming to here today. Um, I didn't think I was to wear, so tough. <laughs> I'd show off. <laughs> now you kept saying, oh, don't be tough. You know, it doesn't matter. Yeah, you look lovely. You're confident enough, aren't you? So don't worry. I can't think it's got Malibu, Julian. Oh, so, I thought it was orange. <laughs> I've got eight easy jet vouchers today. <laughs> easy tickets. What <laughs> <laughs> right, resemblance do you think? <laughs> His face might be on the money, but Stelios still has to pay. Have a beer? Two vouchers. Two vouchers, OK. <laughs> Forgotten, Katrina makes the most of her night out. I've been on dance floor since our wedding day. So I haven't had a dance at all nearly a year, and that's not like me. I mean, earlier on, when I came in, obviously I was living with 
away at me because I've got the scar showing for the first time. But um, Ginny's like, oh no, you'll be fine, you'll be fine in the dark room, you know, get used to it like that way. No, it was a big bright light of me on stage showing it off. <laughs> but that's um, taking that worst bit away now, I don't have to worry about it anymore, do and for Jane, a day to remember. I'm glad I'm staying because last year has been the best. Next year, I don't know. Anything could happen. I could still be here. Take each day as it comes. I'll never plan anything. Never. The summer season has come to an end. For Jane, as ever, it's been a busy time. But despite all the flack, she believes this is the job for her, for the time being. Kevin has not had a good summer. After trouble on the tarmac, he's disillusioned with dispatching. A move into customer relations is planned. Katrina has a lot to celebrate. This time last year, it looked doubtful she'd ever return to work. But her courage and determination have carried her through. And she faces the future with a smile.